Hi, I am a consultant at Kapar. As you guys know, our motive is to give our maximum love, support and care to kids who are in need and their families. In today's episode, I am going to talk to you about role of psychologist in autism. Autism spectrum disorder is a complex neurodevelopmental disorder that affects behavior, communication and social functioning. Psychologists can play an important role diagnosing ASD and helping people cope up with and manage the challenges associated with the disorder. Let us have a quick glance about autism. As the term spectrum suggests, ASD symptoms exist along a continuum. Some people with the disorders are able to succeed in traditional schools, hold jobs and perform functions of daily living with varying levels of support. Others have significant intellectual impairments and will need extensive support and assistance throughout their lives. While ASD is a diverse disorder, the condition is commonly characterized by certain repetitive behaviors and difficulty with social interaction and communication. Some common signs and symptoms include failure to engage in typical babbling or pointing in infancy, failure to make eye contact beginning in infancy, failure to respond to one's own name, loss of previously acquired language or social skills, usually during the second year of life, unusual responses to sensory input. Each person with ASD is a different and has a range of strengths and challenges. Psychologists can make a recommendation based on an individual cognitive behavior, emotional and academic needs. Those treatment plan can help ABA therapists, educators and other capitalized on individual strength and accommodate any challenges. ASD is a condition that lasts a lifetime as the patients grow. Psychologists create a new treatment plan to help patients and their families succeed at a key transition point, such as starting school, entering adolescence, or moving into adulthood. Psychologists can also help the specific challenges that arise for a people with ASD and their families. Such service includes treatment to help people with ASD manage anxiety or mood disorder such as depression this often includes modified cognitive behavior therapy a method that helps individuals challenge negative thoughts and behavior treatments to help manage sleeping and feeding problem that often coincide with asd social skills group to help with asd improve conversational skills nonverbal communication and play Individual psychotherapy to help adults with autism improve marital and other family relationships and improve life skills necessary for employment. For people with more severe cognitive impairments, interventions to decrease aggression and self-injury and improve comprehensions. The goal of psychotherapy may not be cure ASD, but to help people with ASD function at their best and cope with challenges. I hope you got something about how psychologists can help a child with autism. I know you may have doubts and questions about this. Don't hesitate to contact me. It's my pleasure to help you at any time. Feel free to contact me. To know more about on autism, visit our website www.caparforautism.com www.caparforautism.com Com. So today I'm going I'm going to wind up the session. Thank you all for listening. I will be back soon with another informative talk. And by this I'm signing off.